Hello guys, Insane Hulk here. We're going to give you more information now on what has been going on in the past weeks, even on the development side. So be sure to stay there until the end of the video because we have a lot of things to tell you and a lot of important things. So yeah. Uh, first of all, we're going to talk about the logo removal. As you may know and as you may saw, <laughs> Uh, we removed our logos and even our uh, banner on different uh, platforms such as Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Twitch, and even our official website and forum. So why? Uh, for those who actually saw the message that we posted on the forum, uh, you guys may actually already know that, but I'm going to explain again for people that don't know. Uh, we received a mail from EA. Um, that was stating that uh, we're using uh, the Battleforge in the logo that we were using, the official IP logo. So they wanted us to remove this logo because it was copyrighted and under IP protection laws. So I want to explain how the IP protections work. If you want to maybe have more additional information on that, you can just Google it and find more information on the internet. Uh, but so far, when we received this message, um, we were thinking that we're doomed. <laughs> uh, but the message in general was just saying that we had to remove the logo. So what we did is actually what they said and what they asked. So we just removed our logo and everything that may be interpreted like a link to EA. Because the main part of this mail was to be sure that we're not using IP um protection image or whatever such as the, the old logo but also they didn't want it, uh, you guys to interpret the fact that our project may be linked to EA and that's true and I'm going to maybe to remind you that guys uh, we're not linked to EA in any way uh, EA has nothing to do with this project so just want to make things clear um, you guys may know what a private server is, I hope so. Uh, we're more or less a private server. Uh, we're not linked to it, as some World of Warcraft private server are not linked to Blizzard. So, working the same way. Um, the only thing that we're doing is reviving this game because we loved it so much. And that's the only thing we want to do. We're not going to make money, we're not going to sell every f some stuff on the shop uh, on what kind of shop we can have uh, we're, we're not going to do that we just want to revive this game and that's why we're only accepting donations to actually survive and that's it so we're not linked to EA we're just surviving through donations and even our own money when sometimes we don't have as much donation as we expect but well, in the past years, it never happened so far. So thank you for all the support, guys. And that's pretty it. So be sure to keep in mind that we're not EA and we're not linked to EA in any way. So just want to make things clear about that. Uh, so just to go back on the logo, yeah, we removed the logo. So as some of you may saw on the forum, we are actually doing a logo contest right now. So you guys can enter in if you're actually a designer and you want to make try an entry um, so the main goal of this contest is having a new logo uh, the icon version of it and the regular version of it um, so that's just it because we have to replace our beautiful placeholder that we have right now <laughs> and yeah so that's why we made this contest actually because we don't have any designer in our team um, and maybe thanks to the con this contest, we may find some uh, talent guys uh, in our community. So if the work that the guy is doing is really well, we'll maybe think about adding a, des adding a designer in our team because it's really going to be a need so far to make some buttons, logo, images. So we're going to think about that so far and be sure to enter this contest, even if you don't want the access uh, <laughs> I'm sure you guys want um, because the winner will of course win is better access to the actual beta going on and if the work is really impressive so far and really well we're maybe going to think about adding a designer uh, in our team so 
uh, we discussed about it a few days ago and yeah adding a designer won't be a bad thing so far we actually uh, have some contacts that may be good designers but uh, having a good designer and working for free on a project because as you may know we're all working on our free time and for free we we're earning nothing with this project and that's the main purpose of this project earning nothing and reviving this beautiful game um, so yeah finding someone that want to work for free on a project is kind of hard so um, that's why we're making most of the time contests because we cannot make ourselves some logos, some image, and all the help that you guys are giving to us is really helpful and we really appreciate every kind of support that you guys are actually giving us. It's so cool to actually see how you guys are so so on this project. You really want this game back and we actually see it every day and Without the community like you, I think this project will be down since <laughs> since uh, since a long time now. So thank you guys for all the support that you're actually giving to us and it's really giving us some hopes and well, we'll ha we'll just happy I would say because I <laughs> I don't know what to say. But thank you, Ex except th saying thank you every time we gonna say more. So <laughs> so sorry, but thank you for all the support and we're going to do however possible to actually let you get in as fast as possible. Um, so just to go back on this, um, we're maybe going to actually talk a bit about the progress maybe of the closed beta and after additional information about the project. So the progress in general. Um, we didn't really have a new feature since all of them are pretty now integrated and coded. There is still little bugs and little optimization problem that we're working on such are the architecture of our server and even the software architecture of our server so we're working on that since um since weeks and months now uh it's really we're really progressing well and for now it's just about bug testing bug fixing and optimizing so that's why we cannot really uh let people enter um much because for now this server is not stable that much for many players so that's why we're working on the optimization to maybe let you guys enter in the future then um so that's all that have been maybe done in general because i don't want to maybe go in the details um if you want maybe some more information, you can just go on the dev platform. A link will be in the description of this video. So if you guys don't know what the dev platform is, I just invite you to check that out. And we're just giving some updates uh, every week uh, about what has been done in the past week. And we're just updating you about the progress in general of the development and the project. So don't hesitate to follow that. Uh, so about the progress in general, that's what have we done so far. Um, but we are actually progressing. Don't think that in, if we don't tell you anything, that means that we're not progressing. That's not true. We're progressing, but we're only giving you the information when we're sure that it's fixed or it has been done correctly. So, uh, we're working on tons of things and it's, it's, it's going well so far. So, um, maybe now more information about the, uh, project in general um, so as we said we change our logo but as you may know we also change our name so we're not a BF Reborn or Balforge Reborn anymore uh, we are now Skylords Reborn and our new URL because we're going to change that won't be bfreborn.com but skylords.eu um, we're going to change that in the upcoming days or weeks, so we have to actually uh, change all our word direction links, so it's going to take maybe some time. Uh, but we're going to do that in the meanwhile, so you won't maybe see a difference. We're just going to change this URL uh, as fast as possible. Uh, also, this name change doesn't have anything to do with the mail we received with EA, but we just thought that to actually uh, maybe give them as proof that we're not linked to them and maybe for people that were thinking that we're well linked to 
to them because of the battle forging name of our project uh, we just wanted to rename it so um, that's why we renamed it in sky lord reborn uh, so we actually changed it pretty everywhere on facebook twitter you maybe saw it um, not twitter by the way but we changed it pretty everywhere and so now it's just a matter of the URL. But also, we cannot actually, maybe some of you know, but we cannot change the uh, the Twitch URL, the Twitch name channel, and even the Twitter one. Um, so the problem is that we'll have to create new ones. Um, so the new URLs of our Twitch channel and our Twitter will be in the description as well. So be sure to follow the new ones because we're maybe going to give you more information on them, contests, giveaways, etc., and even streams, uh, because we're streaming much more than before now. Um, so yeah, be sure to follow the new ones. I count on you for that. And uh, I think that's it for the links in general and the information. Just want to add something maybe. Uh, if you guys have any questions about what we said in this video, um about the mail that we received about the the project in general whatever if your question has not been answered in the faq that we have on the forum then be sure to ask it at the bottom of this video in the comment section uh we'll try to answer everyone as much as possible uh if you guys have any anything to to tell us uh be sure to do it by the way i Maybe you want to add something um, just about the other social medias that exist on the internet, such as the uh, Reddit uh, that was not uh, made by us, and even the VK, so the Russian based version of Facebook. Um, because I know that those pages exist, we know that those pages exist because we're actually following what they're actually saying and what they're actually doing. Uh, just want to maybe add some information for them. Um, I don't know how VK is working on it or even read it, but if um, the owner of those pages can actually also change the names of them, so from Balfour's Reborn to Skylord's Reborn, uh, we will really appreciate that. Um, because yeah, those pages are not managed by us, but they still exist, so people can actually interpret that on their page that uh, our project may be linked to EA. So. To be sure that everyone on every page that exists on the internet are thinking that we're nothing to EA, <laughs> so the, the right thinking, um, I invite you, the owner of those pages, to actually change the name of, of your page. Um, anyway, thank you guys for all the support as usual. Um, we really appreciate what you guys have been doing uh, on the forum, all your activity, uh, all your comments, all your everything that you guys were doing so far we really appreciate that and that's it so thank you for all the support guys and uh, we'll see you in the forge as soon as possible thank you guys